<clears throat> anyway, so I'm going to be talking about um, this be Brian Adams' uh, first live album. It's called Live, Live, Live. It was released in uh, 1988. Um, played 17 songs, a lot. A lot of songs um, on this album, quite a bit. There's, I would say that's a lot. Um, so there's the inside of it. back yeah so like I said there's lots of songs so it starts off with uh, she's only happy when she's dancing which that song came off of um, I believe it was reckless that album then he's saying um, it's only love that's a great song um, which I believe he might have, I'm not sure, I don't think it was this one, but I know the original one, um, off of the album Reckless, which I do have that on vinyl if you want to check that one out. Um, and I also have Cuts Like a Knife as well on vinyl if you want to check that out as well. Um, not sure, I know because the original one off, uh, off Reckless, that album, he sang it with Tina Turner. Um, after that song is Cuts Like a Knife, Kids Want to Rock, great rocking tune there, um, Hearts on Fire, Take Me Back, The Best Was Yet to Come, that's a great song, The Best Is Yet to Come, Heaven, Heat of the Night, Run to You, One Night Love Affair, Long Gone, Summer of 69, Somebody, and then he covered a song, I'm um, not sure exactly who sang, uh, Walking After Midnight. Um, might say here, um, but yeah, I believe that was a cover, if I'm not mistaken. It didn't say exactly who, who, uh, sang that song. Do you know exactly who sang that song? I'm, so I know that was, I, I'm pretty sure that might have been a cover, um, yeah, Walking After Midnight, and then he, after that song is I Fought the Law, which I believe is another cover, if I'm not mistaken, because it wasn't on any of his, those two songs were on any of his studio albums, um, so by that time he had, let me see how many studio albums, I mean, he had about five studio albums before this came out. And the very last song on here, the 17, the very last is Into the Fire. Um, what a great live album. Uh, definitely for sure. If you're a fan of his music, uh, definitely, definitely worth checking out. There's the back if you want to see Um, Like I said... Great, great um, album. Like I said, this is his first first live album. Um, but a lot of great songs, like pretty much every yeah every song on here. Um, I love every single song on here. Great live album. 
Um, so if you ever want to check it out, get to ch you know, and you like his music, if you're a fan of his music, definitely worth checking out for sure. Um, so I'll go through the songs again, um, and I'm going to uh, finish it off. Um, but yeah, this was like a great, great album. So it starts off with, she's only happy when she's dancing. It's only love. Cuts like a knife. Kids want to rock. Hearts on fire. Take me back. The best was yet to come. Heaven. Heat of the night. Run to you. One night love affair. Long gone. Summer of 69. Somebody. Walking after midnight. I fought the law into the fire. So, um, those, yeah, those uh, other two songs, Walking Out to Midnight, I'm not sure exactly who sings those songs, um, that song, or I Fought the Law, I heard that song. Not exactly sure. Um, I don't think he wrote those two songs. I'm not sure exactly what, what, um, not exactly sure exactly what, um, if he wrote those songs, um, I'm pretty sure those two were covers, um, but let me know if you know exactly who, uh, were the original ones that wrote those two songs, um, Walking After Midnight and I Fought the Law. Not exactly sure, um, who did, but, uh, let me know down in the comments, um, uh, what your favorite album of his is, um, and also check out Classic vinyl spotlight um is where i show my vinyl collection if you want to check that out uh it's not a big big collection um but i do have quite a few like a brian adams couple of his bob seeger a couple of his and, and i have oh, quite a bit more um as well as music dvds i have lots of those if you want to check those ones out um so an easy way to find just type in my name, type in, instead of scrolling down, having this, you know, just type in uh, music DVD review, and all of them should come up. So let me know what you think of this album. Uh, there's the back of it again. Um, definitely a great, great live album, for sure. I'm a big fan, you know, of his music. Um, like I said, I, I don't know if you know yet, but... Um, yeah, I did go to one of his concerts the last time he played, um, and it was unbelievable. said I brought one of the, uh, records, I believe it was, I can't remember, one of them, and, um, yeah, it was unbelievable. I brought in quite close, and, um, and, yeah, it was unbelievable. Like, he looked at, you know, talking, you know, when some famous rock star kind of talks to you, you know, it's, you don't know what to say, but yeah, that was unbelievable. Um, didn't know what to say. I was kind of like, you know, um, but anyways, uh, yeah, this is an excellent album. So let me know uh, down in the comments. Uh, make sure to hit that thumbs up and so appreciate it for all you people uh, supporting my channel. Greatly, greatly appreciate it for that. So thank you. Thank you very much for that. And I'm going to do more album, uh, classic album spotlight. Um, I have quite a few more to do. So um, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, bye.